Hey guys, what's up? It's Hollywood Kinda Guy here. Back at it again for, well, something that I kinda wanted to do though. So, to set this all up, if you guys are familiar with the companies like Miramax, Touchstone, Hollywood Pictures, and Dimension, then, excuse me, then you probably know that some of the Miramax and, Miramax and um, Dimension were now owned by Lionsgate. And then after that, they were owned by Paramount. Well, that just, this just gave me a theory. Of the Paramount Blu-rays that, uh, well, of all the Miramax movies and Dimension movies that Paramount re-released on Blu-ray, that gave me a remarkable theory. Do they have the Paramount logo on them? Or do they have like the regular, regular logo on them? Is it a reprint or a, re or a reboot, basically? For an exit, for an exit, so yeah. And today, we're gonna find out about that today. For this video, we'll be using the 2020 Blu-ray reprint of Serendipity as an example. This I got from Amazon yesterday. I already tried out the code, so it's not going to work. See? Typical standard Paramount Blu-ray that you typically see. So, now, let's test out the theory. Is it going to have the Paramount logo or the Lionsgate logo? Because originally, Serendip when Serendipity was first released on Blu-ray, it was released by Lionsgate. So, is it going to have the Lionsgate logo or the Paramount logo? Let's find out. Today. Welp, looks like I was wrong. My theory was wrong. It's actually Lionsgate instead of Paramount. Kinda interesting, you know? Yep. I was right. I mean, I was wrong, basically. Oh, and there's a Miramax logo, by the way, in case any of you wanted to still see it. Here we go. Miramax. Ba Bam. All right. Here you go, everyone. First, owned by Disney. Second, sold by Disney to Lionsgate. And then, sold by Lionsgate to Paramount. So anyways, if y'all wanted to discover if this theory was true, well, you finally now have your answer. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. This is Hollywood Kinda Guy, signing you off.